hello everyone welcome in next video so uh, in this video we're going to see like how we can schedule the starting or rebooting of the server or the pc automatically so this time this type of activity we usually see whenever the new server a patch upgrade or new antivirus or windows uh, is the windows upgrade is scheduled for the server so this type of activity is required so so like in this video we'll see how we can schedule it so we have two different ways either we can go with task scheduler or we can just run some commands on the cmd and we can just restart it so what is task scheduler so basically uh, task schedulers are the like kind of a job that gets created inside your uh, task bar so whatever the time action and preferences you select based on that that particular uh, action gets triggered and that operation gets completed in inside the pc so for this like we will be we will be uh, creating one task scheduler and seeing that how we can uh, shut down or restart our pc so task schedule windows utility that allows users to automate the tasks such as running a program scripts specific time whenever certain events are occurs okay so you can just find a task scheduler in the search bar you will be getting this window so you can just either you can create a new folder or you can directly go into the creating task you can put the name you can put the name here and trigger like whenever you want to uh, trigger and how many times uh, how many recurrences you want so you can just put the date time and all the occurrences and you can continue and uh, for the restarting or setting down you can just select the shutdown exe and you can put the arguments and condition and it will be executed it's a power the for the power supply if you wanted to check whether the supply is or battery power is enough so you can just put that mark if computer have uh, enough battery power to restarting it or it is connected to the uh, like electricity directly so it will be executed you can put some settings if you want otherwise you can skip it so once the folder is created once the task is added here so you can just run it and whenever the times uh time selected time uh, comes or uh, like selected times meet with the like uh, expectation so it will be executed okay so this was the first thing and the second thing like we can directly go into the cmd we can run shutdown slash r r means restart command and it will be restarting immediately so this is the second way okay so let's let me show you how you can do that okay so let's find task scheduler firstly so so this is the task scheduler if you can see my screen so currently like we have only one folder so you have a two options either you can create the new folder here or if you wanted to put your job inside this scheduler only so you can also create here so what you have to do you have a two options here basic task scheduler and create task so you can go with this create task a basic task scheduler is also but you will get the less option yes but here you will get the more option like timing power consumption and uh, occurrences like you will get the multiple options here so general you will have to put the name here kind of restart okay then when the user logged on you and the uh, group and everything user you can select it so currently i'm logged in with my user so i'm getting this one here so just you can go ahead and okay okay so task name okay so restart okay so trigger if you want to at the condition occurrences so you can say one time this date time schedule should be executed at this time so, so you can if you wanted to put any end time you can also put that so you want to be executed this one once daily weekly monthly or any certain date so you can just put a day one occurrence and you can put any certain date here okay and one time also you can put in certain date so this could be a triggers whatever the condition you wanted to put you can put here action like what you want to uh, want that task to to be done when the time meets or when the condition meets so 
we wanted to restart it so you can just put the start the program so we have already some scripts and programs are defined inside our pc so we can just browse it so you will also you also you already get the like uh, that execution file inside the system 32 so you can just find it here sorry uh, shutdown exe okay and you can just open it so you see the shutdown exe is selected so whenever this time or condition meets this exe will be executed and it will be restarted okay so you can just select from here and condition if you want to put any more conditions here mean is battery and power condition so you can put here any more condition you wanted to keep here so you can keep it and click on the ok so once you click on the ok the task will be visible here if it is running well and good if it is not running it's in ready condition so you can just right click here uh, same way let me i can i can show you other further so like this you can see this one is ready so if you wanted to run it so just right click and click on the run and it will be started okay so you will you will be seeing that task here so once ever, whenever the time will be meeting so it will be automatically rebooting or restarting your server or pc okay and the second condition is shutdown slash r so search here cmd directly you can run it on admin way shutdown okay slash r so it will uh, hit enter it will directly restart in your pc i am not going gonna be hitting it otherwise it will be starting my pc so i want uh, my recording will stop okay so so this was the all let me know in case of any doubt or query thank you so much have a good day